welcome to today's video and today I'm doing a collab with my friend Anna and she's doing gift ideas for Christmas for anybody um, boy or girl and I am doing DIY Christmas decor um, yeah <laughs> and um, I will show you a clip of her right now um, here on her channel so Check it out right now. Hi, my name is Anna Marin, and on my channel, I'm doing five DIY gift ideas for friends and family and just anyone that you know. You should go check out my channel after you watch this video because I know it's going to be great, so stay tuned. Alright, so without further ado, let's get ready to see some of the DIYs I have for you. For this first DIY, you are going to need a margarita glass, uh, some fake snow, or some ripped up tissue paper, plastic tree, and a red toy car. And if you can get the Christmas vacation car, then good. So first I'm going to start off by pouring out the snow, and then taking my margarita glass and measuring it um, about how much snow I need. And for this DIY, you're just going to have to... Um, when, wherever you're putting this decoration, make sure to make it while you are putting it where you want it. And just put the car, and then you can put the tree on top. I didn't tie it, but you can or whatever, but it should stay. Um, and then just remove the excess snow from the sides. If you want it in the jar, that's great. Um, it was my idea just to use a wine glass or some huge wine glass because it looks cool. Um, to me it does. Um, but this is the actual regular DIY. All you gotta do is put the snow in the bottom, place the car on top of the snow, and then place the tree on top of the car. So that's pretty simple. For this DIY, I kind of recreated the look, and it still kind of looks like the picture, but here's my creation. First supply you will need is some fake leaves or some mistletoe. I just couldn't find any, so I just used leaves. You will also need a jar of some sort of shape. You will also need a white candlestick, some scissors, a hole puncher, and some paper. And lastly, some string. So first what you're going to do is put the candle in the middle of the jar. And you want to glue the candle to the bottom. And then place your leaves how you want them. Now all you want to do is draw a shape like this, as you can see. And don't make it very big, but make it you know, a decent size. It's like a little note card on the string. And then just cut it out to make this little shape here. Lastly, just punch a hole in your paper, which I couldn't apparently get. <laughs> um, and then string your string through the hole. And then just tie that around the vase. I don't know why that's there, but I'm guessing you can give it to a friend, some a vase to a friend with a flower or the leaves. But um, I think it just looks pretty as a decoration, um, and then just cut off the excess. For this DIY, you will be making a Merry Christmas painting. For this DIY, you will need some pom pom balls, some red and green paint and a strips of duct tape um, with the words Merry Christmas on the paper and then just dot your paint everywhere on your paper I mean everywhere 
and you want to mix the green and red together and spread this is pretty self-explanatory just pull the tape off and there you have it the Merry Christmas painting So for this Christmas countdown calendar, first you will need um, a whiteboard, some plastic cups, some duct tape, a marker, tissue paper, some candy to put in your cups. And then all you got to do is put four rows of six plastic cups and then just place some candy in every single cup. What I do is wrap the tissue paper around the cup, nice and tight to fit the bottom, and then cut off the excess tissue paper. And lastly, just put the tape on the back of the tissue of the tissue paper and the cup, and hold it all together. Make sure all the pieces are together, and then place your cup that has the candy in it on top of the board and then just repeat this process with all the other cups once you have finished with all these cups write the numbers 1 through 24 on all the cups just like this. So for this DIY, every day of December, you will punch a hole through one of the cups and you will get your candy you have placed in those cups. So it's kind of a fun thing to have every day and it also gives you something to do. So for this last DIY, you will need some scissors, some green fabric, some small sticks, a marker, some small cylinder, pieces of wood, and some wood glue. And then just search up a outline of a tree and print it out on paper so that you can use it as a stencil for cutting out your little tree fabric. Just trace out the tree onto the fabric and make sure you fold um, the fabric in half so that you can have two pieces. So just trace the tree and then you have two pieces and then you make another couple pieces um, and you can make more trees um, but I just did this amount of trees and just take your stick and take the wood glue and paint the wood glue into the middle of the tree so on the fold of the tree and then paint the wood glue all over the stick until you like halfway and then just glue the other pieces of tree I guess green leaves of the tree <laughs> to the little stick and once you've gotten all your little leaves tree leaves I guess you could say um, just do glue the two wood cylinders together and I got glue around it so I just took it off with some water a wet cloth um, and then just put it in with glue or you could drill a hole in the wood and place it in there there you go that's all the DIYs Thanks for watching, I hope you liked it.
and go check out my last videos um, on my channel. And thank you for watching, and goodbye, my mystical creatures.